I'm Hannah Lee. I'm the account director at Mint Williams, and we're a brand and design agency based in Bath, and we are currently going through the B Corp process ourselves. I'm also the regional director for the PM Forum Committee in the Southwest. So the idea of B Corp is this uh, is is a philosophical, even maybe spiritual outlook for some people, which is that business has a role to play in society, that it's lost its way, that it's not fundamentally bad, um, but it has a purpose to play that's different from other things, that's different from the family, that's different from government, that's different from charities. Uh, and there's a, there's a better way of doing it. And that sometimes that involves sacrifice, but it's not always a zero-sum game. So again, we had all of these inputs and all of these different strands. How do we bring this together? And, and really feeling like a sense of responsibility that within our within our business that you know we've been always almost subservient to our clients how can we be a more positive influence on society and start to guide this amazing amount of wealth towards more positive things and help and help our clients so what we really needed was an external referee and that's what b corp was for us as a firm we knew it would be right for us from day one but the partnership still took a lot of convincing and so this is this has to be enshrined in the partnership deed. This is this is big stuff and it's a big decision. Um, but yeah, but we, we did get there. But becoming a B Corp, it gave us a reason to define our purpose. Even though if our ethos had been there, buzzing around in the background, def- guiding us for 50 years, but there was a reason to define that purpose. Paul, did you have a dedicated team? Uh, <laughs> team's probably too grandiose a word, um, but it, was, um, it has to come from the top in my mind. So you've got... Um, You've got you've got to get COO and CEO buy-in, and then and then you uh, I think uh, you know you then create someone's role. And for our person, it was a you know it was a council towards the CEO who, who sort of led on this. And then you've and then you've got to get people who are really like-minded and passionate about this area. And for us, it was two or three grads that helped with the heavy lifting. Um, but but if you haven't got that, it needs to be cross-functional. I think. It will be a failure if it comes from marketing solely. I'd add that uh, to that. Operations, they are the unsung heroes of, of B Corp's operations teams. Um, definitely ours were, like, reaching net zero, all of that. That is, that is a lot of that is down to the operations team and making sure that, that we're on track. There's a big difference between filling in the assessment successfully and being B Corp-esque. If you fill in the assessment successfully... Um, you can't necessarily expect to be a B Corp in five years' time. I don't mean be a B Corp certified. I mean who you are as a business. This fundamentally is about trying to answer who do you want to be as a business. 